Welcome to the React.js tutorial series. In this series, we'll be focusing on React.js, how to create the React application from scratch. We'll learn about how to set up the environment, how we can work with the components and uh, the component interactions, as well as how we can uh, use the extended utilities within the React.js. So I'll start with the fundamental of React.js and a brief background of it. What is React? So it's an open source JavaScript library. It's not a framework. It's focuses on UI aspects only. Unlike other frameworks like uh, uh, Angular and Vue, it's just focuses on the view part of it rather than like controlling and the model part. Background of it. So it was firstly designed by Jordan Walk and firstly deployed at Facebook in 2011. And post-2013, it was declared as an open source in a JS conference. So React is a component-based architecture. So what that means? Think about one site which is having header, footer, left navigation and the center part. And center part could also have news feeds or quick links sort of components. So these individual components can be mantled or created individually and can be reused across any other sites as well. That sort of liberty this React uh, library provides us. React is a big community at the GitHub. If you would like to collaborate and uh, uh, contribute to it, you can join that there as well. So the foremost question, why should we learn it? Why you are here in this channel? The number one thing is skill set in demand. So UI developer is an aw awesome skill to have in today's industry where many of the organization and many of the product companies are looking for having good rich products UI websites and online products UI so that's why if you are in a UI development domain then you should uh, take a look on react.js it uses a declarative approach rather than imperative so what that means so declarative means rather than giving individual directions or the each and every step you can just do a I mean just command it what what sort of uh, product you would like to build so for example if you would like to let's say if you are in a restaurant and uh, you would like to have pasta then you would not be going to chef and telling like what sausages or what recipe he should be following you'll be just giving your order that you need pasta an awesome pasta so that would take care of it so that's why like, it is a declarative approach so React works on the virtual DOM manipulations. So unlike the Angular and the other frameworks, those do have expensive DOM manipulations whenever something gets changed on a page. So React believes in virtual DOM manipulations rather than actual DOM manipulations, which gives us a fast efficiency and the component load time get reduced to a drastically. Prerequisites. What you should be knowing before starting with React.js? So you should be knowing the basics of HTML, CSS, JavaScript and a bit of ES6 as well because uh, we are going to use this modern JavaScript for building out the stuff. So not too much expand, you, would be, you should be knowing a bit of basics rather like um, how to declare the variables with let, constants and as well as how to import the classes or the libraries. Series content, as I told you initially in the start as well, we will be focusing on fundamentals then environment setup and then uh, building out the components, classes, functions. We'll be focusing on the interaction with components, how the states and properties can be used. And then uh, we'll create a real-time application which, which will be, uh, we'll be together doing step by step. We'll be do, deb doing the debugging, we'll be deploying it. And finally, we'll, we'll get a working product out of it. And I hope in the end of this pro, uh, the entire series, you would be able to understand the basics and you would be in the shape of building out your applications. And when you keep on practicing the same stuff, you would be a pro in this area. And uh, soon you will find yourself in an awesome, impressive resume. So just wait for my next session where we will talk about the environment setup and the fundamentals. Thank you.